So, what was really going on with the Resident Evil 2 remake? Well, let's go to Google and see if we can dig up some information, some recent information about the Resident Evil 2 remake. So I'm on Google right now and I typed in Resident Evil 2 Remake and, uh, well, not all that much has popped up. It's just all speculation. So I guess, unfortunately, here in this video, that's what we're going to have to do as well. Just kind of speculate and try and hopefully answer that question. What is really going on with the Resident Evil 2 Remake? Because you look at the Resident Evil 2 Remake and, bro, they haven't talked about it since 2015. What's going on? Now, luckily, as of this recording, well, E3 2017, it's right around the corner. So gamers are getting excited. There's a lot of cool announcements coming. And what if Capcom has a surprise up their sleeve, and at E3 2017, they show off gameplay from the Resident Evil 2 remake? Wouldn't that be amazing? And the gameplay features that old-school, classic Resident Evil gameplay. I'd be so freaking excited. I'd probably literally jump up and down as I'm watching that reveal. You know what I mean? That's how much of a nerd I am in regards to the classic Resident Evil formula. And if if they built this game from the ground up on current hardware, bro, and it features background, pre-rendered backgrounds, bro, this game is going to look so unbelievably amazing. You know what I mean? I mean, it might look as good as freaking Avatar. <laughs> I mean, that might be a little far-fetched, but it's going to look good. But what if they do show off the Resident Evil 2 remake at E3 2017 and they just kind of drop the ball with this one? What if it features first-person gameplay? You know, because here's the thing. I think they're going to have to put a modern-day spin on this remake in order for it to work. I don't just think this is going to be a copy and paste of the original game with updated visuals. Now, obviously, I'm hoping that I'm wrong there. I want to experience the classic Resident Evil gameplay here in the remake, but I think the modern-day spin is a necessity in order to get people to care about this because there's a lot of younger gamers out there, especially, that don't even know about Resident Evil 2. And if they just show off gameplay that features fixed camera angles and tank controls, I don't really think that's going to excite the masses. You know what I mean? So I think it's fair to say that Capcom could have potentially dropped the ball here. And if they do potentially drop that ball, this could potentially fail. Now, obviously, all of this is just speculation. And I know some gamers are going to be like, you don't know what you're talking about, Michael. Bro, it's speculation. Come on. Chill out. There's no concrete information here. I'm just saying it seems logical that they would put a modern-day spin here on this remake. But really, I guess time will tell. You know, E3 2017, it's right around the corner. Hopefully, we get some concrete information. And if we do, I will update you guys with a brand new video with all of that concrete information. So be sure to subscribe. But what if they don't show it off at E3? Wouldn't that suck? And uh, we're just left in the dark some more. That would just be the worst case scenario. But hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, let me know your thoughts on the Resident Evil 2 remake. And I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching.